Thank you for calling. This is Dawn. Hey, Dawn. Uh, I'm a tenant here, and I have a question. Uh, who is this? Uh, my name is Steve Dave. Okay. And um, I, I just... Where do you live? Apartment 2655. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. So I've been, using, I've been using the satellite dish, um, you know, that's above my apartment. I've been, I hooked it up to my computer. I've been sending signals into space. Mm-hmm. And it seems like it's created sort of a feedback loop. I don't know if you've heard the, the low frequency vibrations at night. You know, when everything's quiet, you can kind of hear it. No, I haven't, but... Okay, well, here's the, the problem. The, the, basically, the sun keeps that from getting out of control, and we're going to have this eclipse coming up, whatever day that is, the 21st. Mm-hmm, that's Monday, I think. Oh, crap. I'm not going to have time to shut it down by, before then. Um, the, the sun's been kind of like a buffer, and I don't know. When that eclipse happens, it's going to get crazy. Uh, right above the apartment complex, there's going to be sonic booms and stuff, like really, really loud noises are you killing kidding me no i'm not killing anyone don't put that in anyone kidding in, in, me isn't okay. it? no no I, i'm okay. absolutely this serious is not a joke no, right no i wouldn't kid around i i've been using i've been doing this for months i've been trying to push a uh, um a russian satellite out of position with um microwaves i've been sending microwaves into space and it's caused a okay. f- feedback loop the sun acts as a buffer and when the eclipse happens it's going to sound like the end of the world but it's not going to hurt anything. It's probably just going to crack, crack a few windows, maybe. That's unbelievable. But I have renter's insurance. So if anyone's windows gets cracked, I'll take care of it. I don't want to cause any problems, but... Okay. You know, I never heard of such a thing before in my life. Ah, Are you a scientist, by chance? No. That's why. <laughs> See, yeah, but I definitely watch all kinds of stations, you know. I'm always in the know oh, trying yeah, to learn yeah. stuff. Well, you this know? wouldn't be in the news. This is pretty much cutting-edge technology using okay. microwaves to uh, propel. I-, I was trying to knock the, the satellite out of orbit. I thought it'd be funny because, you know, they're the Russians. But yeah. it's created a feedback loop. It's coming straight back toward the complex. Uh, when you're, like, do you live here at the complex? No, I don't. Okay, I was going to say, like, if you know anyone that lives here, tell them, like, when it's really quiet at night, just to listen for those low-frequency hums. That's that's the feedback uh-huh. loop building up until Monday. Wow. Okay, and so on Monday, it's going to knock everything out, huh? Yeah, well, no, no, it's not going to knock anything out. It's just going to be- make these sonic booms happen repeatedly over the apartment complex. They're going to think, like, okay. aliens are invading or something. But it's nothing like that. Okay. It's just, just normal science stuff. All right. Well, maybe you should tell the police so that they don't. Somebody don't call the police nah, department. Fuck the police. You know? Huh? I said fuck the police. You know? Yeah, but if the people think somebody's shooting out here, they're going to send a bunch of people. Oh here. no, no, it's that's not going to be a problem because this isn't going to sound like gunshots. This is going to sound oh. more like the end of the world. Oh, great. Okay. So there, there's going to be no mistaking this. I'm just, maybe you could post some flyers or something, just letting the residents yeah. know, you know, cutting edge. I will talk to my boss about it. Groundbreaking science experiment um, going on on Monday during the eclipse. If there's any questions about it, can I have your number? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's on caller ID. Also, oh, the, yeah. the, 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 the moon, right. the moon's well, going to have these, for letting me know. I'll talk to my boss about it. All right. The, the moon's going to have these weird wavy things around it too. It's going to look very strange just from our complex. So maybe you guys okay. can cash in on that. Get some tourism over here. <laughs> I'm serious. It's going to look weird. I, I know you're serious. I just, okay. You're going to be able to see sound. You're going to be able to see the sonic booms. Wow. Yeah, yeah, this the this apartment I think complex. I'm going to be up here on Monday night. Yeah, you should be. I mean, it's going to be crazy. Okay. I mean, uh, and you said your name was Steve, right? Yep, Steve Dave. Okay, Steve Davis? Uh, Dave, just Dave. Okay. I prefer the short short right. version. Okay, I got to go. I got people in the office. All right. Yeah, I got to go take a cigarette break. I get it. Oh, no, I don't smoke. I quit smoking. I can tell. You're sounding good. Oh, I'm so glad I quit smoking. Oh, but, you I'm, know, I have a whole bunch of reverb in this phone. I'm proud of you. Yeah, I hear static no. on my end. 
But you know that that could, yeah, uh, I have everything I say comes back at me. Oh, you know what? That's probably the uh, part of the feedback loop. It's the electromagnetic waves interfering with the phone lines. It'll happen probably, and it'll just kind of stop on Monday after the eclipse. Okay. So the phones will be back to normal by then. Well, so will the internet. Okay. All right. Well, thank you for calling. You're welcome. Uh, have a nice day. You too. Goodbye. Goodbye.